Hey y'all, it's Dr. Tiffany. I hope you're doing well. So, um, this one's kind of scary, actually. Um, this came out of the CDC. It slid by under the radar of most people, I'm pretty sure. But uh, apparently, um, a manufacturer who, um, a manufacturer of something called the Vibone or Aloe Os um, bone grafts, uh, well, the uh, subject that the subjects that they took them from had been improperly screened for TB and turned out to be positive. So um, a bunch of people got exposed to tuberculosis. So the number uh, that I heard from my sources in the CDC was 34. Um, 34 p potential exposures. So um, this is kind of a public health uh, thing right here. I'm going to move out of the way. The lot numbers are listed in this paragraph right there. And if you have been, if you did get something from those lot numbers, then uh, you would uh, need to begin treatment. If you did not, then it's not to worry about, okay? So it was just those two lots. It was not a widespread occurrence, but it was something that came across my plate that I felt warranted a public health video, okay? I love you. Stay safe.